We finally got the keys to our new house. So we're gonna go and like clean it up a little bit, take some curtains down that they left, you know, all that stuff. Rudy's a little bit worried. <laughs> he doesn't know that he's coming with us, but he's gonna be excited. He's never had a backyard before. You gonna have a backyard? Is that too fun? Is that too fun? <laughs> But I'll show you once we get there. Here is the living room. Those lights, they have got to get. <laughs> mm -hmm. Cute little arches. A cute little well and Rudy. And I love that this window opens in the middle. That really gets me going. And then... <clears throat> bathroom. Obviously one day we will replace that window because I hate those types of glass. But it's an arch little shower which is just so cute. <coughs> and then here's one bedroom. I think we're going to keep the color. I'm kidding. <laughs> Imagine. <laughs> I love this little built-in. I feel like that's in all like old houses. This house was built in 1930. And this is our bedroom. There's a little bathroom. Hi. It's the tiniest little bathroom ever. But, yeah, okay, so we're in the bedroom and all the bedrooms have like these doors with mirrors, which is really nice. We might paint the wood, I know, controversial to some. Um, so there's two on each side and then the fireplace. I don't love the fireplace. Like, I would honestly maybe like it painted, but that's another story for another day. And then, there's two little windows here. We need a new door because they had cats and that was destroyed. And then there's a little tiny little half bath, which is actually quite cute. But... Um, we need like a sink that mounts on the wall so there's more room because Will is very tall. So when he sits there, his knees touch. But it has tall ceilings and then like a sweet little window, which I love. And then this is the living room. And I just love this window because it opens in the middle. It's just very cute to me. Obviously new sconces, but I love that there's light boxes there, which is nice. And then we'll be scraping the ceiling. Say hi. Hi. I'm giving a tour. YouTube. <laughs> and then the dining room. It's quite big. And they left this hideous light, but, and those hideous, you know, we have to get rid of all of that. I love all the arches, they're so sweet. Um, so this is the dining room, it's quite big, which is nice. And we're also going to redo the floors because they're very stained. And then this room has these weird built-ins that we're going to get rid of and probably just continue this as a butler's pantry because that has a really nice... Butler's pantry here. Obviously an outdated word, but I don't know what else to call it. Just a pantry. Um, then this is the kitchen. They have the most giant fridge that will definitely go. And then the cabinets are interesting. But yeah, I mean, it's like a good size. And we're definitely gonna probably get new cabinets. And if not, then we'll just redo the fronts of these. And then obviously new countertops, get rid of that thing. Yeah, and I love this little thing. I think originally it would be um, an ironing board, but they put little shelves in it, which is kind of sweet. And then this is where the laundry room will be. It needs some help and in the backyard. And then from the bedroom, there's a little office room that will be Rip Will's little room. Also has a nice little closet. I think it also has a, no, this one doesn't have a mirror on it, but 
nice wood door and then going down the hallway i honestly love these we looked at a house one time that was like around this era and also had this this is where the phone used to go and then there's like a little linen closet which is nice oops and then here's the bathroom which i just love the art shower and i do want a different window here because i don't like those but that's a different that's not you know a high on our list and then obviously we're going to redo the floor new vanity new storage all that good stuff and then this is to the basement but it's like a dirt in basement so it's like not worth seeing and then here is the little other bedroom which would be like my closet slash baby room this room gets pretty good light has lots of windows it's a hideous shade of green because why not and then a nice little mirror that needs oh cleaning so badly <laughs> So these are the three colors I was thinking for the bedroom. And these are all Farrow balls. So this is Mizzle, Eddie, and Cromarty. And I think we're gonna do Eddie. It's like a greeny, blue, beigey color, kind of. I think it'll be really pretty. Our pendant light for our dining room thing. It's so pretty. Let me show you. It's like this really beautiful red. Like the perfect red. And then like the glass piece goes under and a little there's like a little gold hook kind of thing. It'll be really pretty in here. And then we're doing like a blue striped rug. So I'm going to come off. So do you think would be so pretty. I love blue and red together. My favorite color combo. So I think that'll be pretty. And then we're doing like wood chairs, wood table. Still trying to find a wood table, but yeah, anything is better than that. What is that? <laughs> we found this door in the basement. Thank you. Yeah. Sorry. And it's really pretty. <laughs> And stinky down here. It's a little stinky down here. Yeah, it is. Wait, it's a really pretty door. Is it? Yeah. Okay, so downstairs there's two tables. They're identical tables. And we think we could paint them and put new knobs on them and maybe put them outside. Yeah, like put like a finish on top. I mean, the wood like needs some help. Lacquer? Like, yeah. So that it's like can go outside or I don't know how that works. Outdoor yeah. paint? Or we have a screened-in porch it could work in because yeah, it, nice it wouldn't get direct rain. Porch. Yeah, but I think they're cute. That point, got some fairroom ball paint. Okay, so we repainted all the windows and all the walls to 
the window to the wall. Also, pretty Facebook market find. <laughs> so zoomed in. <laughs> The, um, this is Pointing by Farron Ball, and this is Simply White by Benjamin Moore, in case you want to know. Did they keep the mantle the same color? It's the color. So the color in the bedroom is Eddie by Farron Ball, which is like a greeny blue gray. It's kind of hard to see on camera, but it's quite pretty. We also got this tile sample, which we're doing like 12 by 12 version in the kitchen. But I was seeing if the six by six would be cute in here, which I think it could be really cute. With this little green color, obviously change that, that new sink. You know the drill. Why am I out of breath? I have no idea. Actually I do know, but I am out of breath just from talking. But yeah, that's the update so far. Hopefully we can get a couch soon and move my like closet stuff here and our bed. That's mostly like the big things we have to move. So trying to do that this week. So we're slowly moving in some stuff because I still have my condo so we can like do it kind of slowly. So we're just bringing like little bits and bobs, you know? I have like, I brought some like, just like suitcases of my clothes because I have a lot of clothes, so that will be interesting. But yeah, it's kind of hard when you're pregnant to bend over and lift stuff up. But I'm doing what I can to be helpful. And yeah, that is where we're at at the moment. One little lone chair. I found this little linen tablecloth. I think that's what it is. <laughs> and it perfectly fits on the window. Obviously, it won't stay like with those holding it up, I can get a little rail thingy. But I love it, it's so cute. Unpacked some books, brought a bunch of clothes, and we got our mattress here. We still have to bring our bed frame. <laughs> Don't worry, we won't be sleeping on the ground. And then, yeah, just, you know, the clothes are slowly coming. I'm very organized, can you tell? <laughs> but yeah, we're trying to sleep here tonight, so we gotta get all of our stuff here. Moving is not that fun, but once you're in, it's better. So yeah, I also love these. They're so cute. All my little cups. My mom got me these little Boston Terrier plates. They're so cute. What else is cute? Um, yeah, I just like, even though the house is chaos, I like to just make little things look pretty. First night in the new house, and me and Ruby are very cozy, watching some TV. Got a little candle going, and 
It's quite nice. No more of the car, okay? Too soon? It's pretty cute there.